Hey guys, so today's video I'm going to share with you all of my favorite face masks. And I feel like Tika's always just chilling in the background of all my videos. So I am a face mask junkie. I pretty much use a face mask every single day. So I've tried a lot and I know which ones I really like. So I just round up my current favorite masks and I'm gonna share them with you guys because maybe you guys are looking for a new mask, I don't know. So before I even jump into the mask, I wanted to show you guys this mask primer. And I didn't even know that a mask primer was a thing because before this, there wasn't. This is the very first mask primer. Um, it's from Origins, it's called the Maskamizer, and you can find this at Sephora. So pretty much all you do is spray this all over your face and then use your hands to pat it in, and then you just go ahead and apply your mask like normal. So this has a marine algae complex and it just helps soften and hydrate your skin so that your skin absorbs the mask benefits better. And as far as masks go, I've been loving the mask of Magnum and Tea. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in one of my uh, current favorites videos recently. Uh, this is what it looks like and it smells so good. It's like minty but also, I don't know, I can't even explain it, but it smells super good. So this is a face and body mask. I've never actually used it anywhere else, but you can. I like using this one if my skin's breaking out or even if my skin is clear. Oh, I just really like it and I'm a huge fan of Lush stuff, so this is definitely one of my favorites. Um, another one of my favorites right now is the Pure Dirty Girl Mask. And this one dries very hard. If you leave it on your skin for too long, it gets really itchy and cracky. But I like that because I feel like it's really drying up any breakouts. So this is my favorite one right now for if my skin is really breaking out. Sometimes I'll just use this as a spot treatment because it is so drying. But it's drying to the places that you want to be dried up. It's not like drying out your whole skin. Um, so yeah, been loving this one. And you can get this at Shoppers Drug Mart, I think. Also, another one I really like that I don't have on hand is the one from Sephora that's really expensive and comes in the little thing. It's called Glam Glow. I had the one that comes in the white packaging and I really liked it except it's really expensive. It was like $50 for like a tiny little thing and also I didn't get to use all of it because it dried out on me. So I don't think I would repurchase it just because I do like some of these masks. Like almost equally as much. Um, but if you're wanting to splurge on a good mask, that one is good. And then last but not least, I'm going to include the Queen Helene Mint Julep Mask. This is a great option if you're just looking for a drugstore face mask. This is like my third or fourth one of these. The packaging has changed since it came out. But it's meant for oily and acne prone skin and I feel like it just really helps to kind of clean out your pores and your skin just feels more clean, <laughs> clean and smooth. I'm not gonna rank this on the top of my favorites because I think I do like all these other masks better than this one. But if you are looking for a drugstore alternative, this one is really good, it's really cheap. I think it's like four or five dollars. If you don't use masks a lot and you're not wanting to spend a lot on one, this is good. But also, if you use masks a ton and you feel bad about using expensive ones all the time, um, this one's really good. I kind of like use this in between these ones so that I am not wasting expensive masks. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want other favorites videos of specific things, let me know. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye. So if you guys want to enter to win a Origins Maskmizer kit, just enter your email at the link I'm going to have right down in the description box and 10 of you guys will be winning. So be sure to go enter. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys soon.